In the second treatise of government, John Locke explains that human rights are rooted in God's rights, since God made us. He explains that we have sacred obligations to preserve God's property in ourselves and in others. He also hints that we are more important than the other things God made because of our higher faculties and because we are in this world on God's business. Here's what he says. The state of nature has a law to govern it, which obliges everyone, and reason, which is that law, teaches all mankind, who will but consult it, that being all equal and independent, no one ought to harm another in his life, health, liberty, or possessions. For men being all the workmanship of one omnipotent and infinitely wise maker, all the servants of one sovereign master, sent into the world by his order, and about his business, they are his property, whose workmanship they are, made to last during his, not one another's pleasure. And being furnished with like faculties, sharing all in one community of nature, there cannot be supposed any such subordination among us that may authorize us to destroy one another, as if we were made for one another's uses, as the inferior ranks of creatures are for ours.